Nearly a third of the Earth's soil is degraded, and an area the size of a soccer field is eroded every five seconds, according to UN figures from 2020. Those close to the issue say the planet is in a crisis. We're quite literally losing soil and therefore the ability to produce food, so we need to change something. We know that soil is the future, and by helping soil do its job better, we're hopefully going to produce food in a more environmentally friendly way. That's Danielle Semple from Farm Ed in the UK. She's at their demonstration farm that has increased the amount of organic matter in the soil through sustainable techniques. Farm Ed grows fruit, vegetables, and wheat using an eight-year crop rotation system that does not need fertilizer or pesticides, which are both made from oil and gas. We know farming and food production is not sustainable anymore. What we're trying to do here is demonstrate all of the different practices that farmers, growers, policy makers, advisors, agronomists could implement on the land. We're not saying what we're doing is the be all and end all. We're just saying that these things are possibilities within a regenerative and sustainable farming and food production. Henry Asplin is with Save Soil, a global campaign to raise awareness about soil health. Save Soil says raising organic matter in soil to a minimum of 3 to 6 percent based on regional conditions is key to making sure it remains healthy. There isn't one necessarily way of bringing organic matter back into soil and as a movement we aren't trying to tell farmers how they need to manage their soil. It's just imperative that farmers are supported to make sure there is a minimum level of organic matter or life in their soil. And this can be done through policy change and incentivizing. He says a failure to implement sustainable policies could have a serious impact on future generations. There are various predictions, uh, various different estimates, but we may reach a point where we aren't able to grow food anymore, that there's no life in our soil. And actually, organic matter depleting isn't just relevant for food. This uh, soil dying will release carbon back into the atmosphere, have a huge biodiversity collapse if this happens. 